welcome back to the Coach Clark Show presented by Buffalo Wild Wings. Now with Stevenson head coach Clark, Clark Nyman, I'm Macy Mitchie. So Clark, we talked a few weeks ago about this heading into the second half of your season after the Diamond City Invitational winter training. Yep. What are your, now we're going into the 2020 MAC championships. What are some of your goals and expectations for the team heading into the championships? Uh, as I explained kind of at the beginning of the year, the expectation for the team is just to get a little bit better. Um, and actually they're showing that they're getting a lot of it better. Um, they're, they're really strong right now. Uh, they feel really good and we're going into our resting cycles. So uh, hopefully with some good recovery, some sleep and uh, a little bit less yardage, they're, they're gonna uh, do really well at uh, MAC championships. Now we talked a little bit about your taper pattern this year. Mm -hmm. What are you guys doing differently that you haven't done in the past in order to get them ready to rest and perform well? I can't tell you my secrets. <laughs> <laughs> now this year we're doing something I call resting cycling. Um, I, I don't know what the technical term for it is. I, I just know that uh, going into these last two weeks, I'm doing a two days on, one day off cycle where they work pretty hard for about two days and then they take a full 48 hours of rest before they get back in and they go again. And um, I mean, at the Diamond City Invitational going into that, I gave them one day off in the middle of the week and that seemed to work out really well. Um, so coming into this week where we're about about two weeks out, about 10 days out, uh, this two on one off thing gonna be, get, goes through about three cycles. And that'll, I think that'll set, it up, set us up really well for them to be um, ready to go for championships. Yeah, of course. Um, talk a little bit about the swimming schedule this year and how your specific schedule is going to prepare the team for the championships. Well, there's one thing that Stevenson has that uh, no other school has, and that's the long winter. Uh, we got it, we were off in December, like the second week of December, mm -hmm. and we didn't go back until this past week. And so it made for a really, really nice um, transition from fall into two a days and hard you know, winter training, and then uh, going into three weeks before championships. And the other thing I'm noticing around the uh, conference is Everyone had their last meet this past weekend. Our last meet was a week ago. So that gives us another, a little bit extra time to sharpen up and yeah. you know, really get our, our uh, details down for our races uh, to go into championships next, next week. Yeah, yeah, it's fast. Coming up soon. <laughs> um, talk a little bit about your lead scorers heading into the MAC championships on both the men and women's side. Uh, we're talking about Mel and uh, Steven, right? Yes. Um, they're, both, they're both ready. I mean, in practice right now, they're feeling really good. Uh, we've been doing a lot of broken swims and, you know, just kind of see where they're at and, you know, how they're feeling in the water. And they're, they're putting up some really big times right now. Yeah. I'm actually really excited to see how they do. And uh, talking to them about their championships, I've sat down with both of them. And um, they're, they're excited. They're ready to go. They feel very confident. They feel they've done everything they need to do to this point. And uh, they're ready to step up at, at championships and, you know, finish out their senior year with a bang. Yeah, of course. Um Going on with that, Mel Milam is the reigning champion in the 200 IM mm -hmm. for the MAC conference. How is she preparing herself for, for her last time around at the MAC championships <laughs> to um, repeat that? She uh, She's focused on it. Like mm -hmm. She tells me all the time that she's watching past year's videos to get yeah. uh, motivation because she really likes the way that uh, the announcer called it. <laughs> and, you know, going into it, we've been talking about how it's been the same journey. Like the, the times going into championships are about the same. Yeah. The, uh, preparation going into championships has been a little bit harder. Mm -hmm. um, and mindset wise, she's ready to go. I, I, I think that she's going to uh, step up this, this next weekend and uh, put on a really big show. Um, and I talked to her that um, no matter what the result at the end of the day, you know, did you put in the work? Um, are you are you doing what you need to do rest wise, and is is this going to be a great cap to your senior year? And she feels confident that that's going that's what's going to happen. That's so. really good to hear. <laughs> um, well, I guess we'll catch up in a few weeks after the championships. Sure. Uh, good luck with the rest of your season. Thank good luck you. at championships. I'm Mason Ishii. This is Clark Nyman for the Coach Clark Show. Thank you.